All right, we're here from St. Joseph, Missouri, Campus of Missouri Western, Site Chiefs Training Camp. I'm under a roof, a golf cart roof, because it's over 100 degrees here. Gonna be 100 degrees the next few days. Pads go on on Friday, nice early test for the defending world champs. And we have five takeaways from their training camp. Takeaway number one, their tackle position might be in the best spot it's been in in Patrick Mahomes' seven years as a pro, and that's saying something. They've had good players come through here. Eric Fisher, Mitchell Schwartz, Orlando Brown, but they really feel like left tackle Donovan Smith and right tackle Juwan Taylor have a chance to raise the bar at the position. Smith looks re-energized coming out of his run as a Tampa Bay Buccaneer, and Taylor looks like he's gonna be worth the $20 million they spent on him back in March. Takeaway number two, the corner position is in a real sweet spot. They have four ascending young players there, all on rookie contracts. Even the injury situation sort of played out in their favor. Legereus Sneed and Trent McDuffie, two top shelf guys, battled injuries in the spring. They're being managed early in camp. That's created opportunity for Jalen Watson and Joshua Williams to really get a lot of quality reps. They feel like they're not only gonna be good at that position, but pretty deep as well. Takeaway number three, if there's a spot that needs to be sorted out, it's definitely a receiver, particularly after Kadarius Toney went down a couple of days ago. And that means young guys stepping up, two in particular, their second round picks from the last two years, Sky Moore and Rashi Rice. Moore has really taken a step forward early in camp. Looks like he has a chance to play an Albert Wilson type of role in Andy Reid's offense. Meanwhile, Rice has bounced back. He was up and down in the spring, but he showed up to camp in much better shape. They're optimistic he's gonna be a day one contributor for them. Takeaway number four, if there is a dark horse early in camp, it's another running back. Last year was Isaiah Pacheco, the seventh round rookie out of Rutgers. This year, it's a guy named Daenerys Prince, an undrafted free agent out of Tulsa, 220 pounds, can catch the ball out of the backfield, can add to an already deep group. And then takeaway number five is real simple. Patrick Mahomes is Patrick Mahomes. The Chiefs are gonna be good because of it. You see it out there on the field, but you also see it in leadership. I was talking to Andy Reid earlier today. He said Mahomes has played such an active role in the development of young guys like Rice, like Moore, and that's gonna make the entire team better. So you heard it here first. The Chiefs are a real contender in 2023. That'll do it from here in St. Joe. Next stop, Minnesota.